couldn't date till I was 16. Is that rude or is that normal? Normal? Okay, all right. So the first boy I dated, his name was Craig. And he, Craig, y'all know a Craig? Okay. <laughs> Craig, let me tell you something, Craig was a bad boy. He was a skater boy. He was an artist. That's kind of cute. But three months into the relationship, he told me something. You want to know? I don't think you're ready. Okay, fine, I'll tell you. He told me that we had to break up. That was my thought. That was my thought. But you know what he said? He said we had to break up because I wasn't going to have sex with him. But wait for it. Wait for it. The second reason? Because he said that I was going to be as fat as his mom. So... So I think about that moment from time to time, and I say, you know what, if I could go back and talk to her, I would say, Ashley, first of all, Craig is a loser. <laughs> Second of all, you is fine. And that bulge on your hip that he's talking about, not only is it okay, but it's gonna change the world someday. This crowd, I need to take y'all everywhere with me. Craig made me feel worthless. He made me feel like my body was nothing. That's right, I am better than Craig. And let me tell you this, cut to many years and experiences later, I met my amazing husband who saw me Justin, I, I know you're up there. But you know what, he saw me. Is he gonna stand up? He's too embarrassed. But you know what guys, he didn't see me for this. He saw me for this, for my worth. And he liked it so much, he put a ring on it. And let me tell you something else. The fashion industry told me that I wasn't gonna be a real model because of all these curves. But now we can cut to me on the cover of Glamour and Vogue and Sports Illustrated. Yes! And guys, I don't know if you know, but Barbie, they also made an AG Barbie, and she doesn't have a thigh gap. It's a, good, it's a really cool thing. So I didn't always appreciate my body. I didn't always appreciate the power that my body gave. And here's what I want from all of you. I want you to skip past all the drama, all the self-doubt that I had to go through and get to the good stuff about owning and loving who you are, okay? You, you guys are the key to your own happiness because I thought I could get happiness from dudes like Craig. Honestly, the more attention that I got from men, the more that I thought I had value. Yeah, I'm speaking some truth right now, okay? But it, always, it wasn't always the right kind of attention, and it always wasn't the right kind of man. It took me a long time to figure out what happy, where happiness comes from. But honestly, happiness comes from doing what you love. And if you don't know what you love doing yet, that's okay, that's all right. Because you guys are still young, and you're molding and creating, this is a great place to be to figure out where, what you love. It comes from accepting love from partners who believe in you instead of partners who disrespect you. And now that I'm in my happy place, you can't tell me nothing because I know I'm good enough, okay? And let me tell you something else. Let me go a little further with you now. I'm acting crazy today. <laughs> Whatever someone thinks is wrong about you, whether it's your opinion or your body, 
That's actually your superpower, okay? What I know now is that from my heart is my power and not, oh, I'm sorry, I'm saying this wrong. I gotta, I gotta get this to you right. What I know now is that my heart of my power is not my beauty, but my willingness to share my deepest vulnerabilities with all of you. Let me tell you, when you share your deepest vulnerabilities with the people next to you, with your friend next to you, and you tell her what you're most insecure about, it's gonna make you feel so much better. It's gonna take you out of that insecurity and it's gonna say, here it is on the table, and it's gonna help you get over whatever it is that you're going through. I'm not here today to make you feel beautiful, whatever that's supposed to mean, all right? I'm here to help you understand that true beauty is okay with being who you are. And being okay with who you are is a revolutionary act, you guys. It really is. And making someone else feel good about who they are, that's downright heroic. And check me out, Wonder Woman, I'm a superhero too. So, okay, so you ready? So let's forget about the Craigs. Let's forget about the haters and the doubters. And let's be the heroes that we are. This is my superwoman move. So tell your friends, your sisters, your classmates that they are a hero. And that true beauty comes from here and here. And it comes from all here. And remember that you are bold, you are brilliant, you are beautiful, you are worthy of anything that you want to accomplish. That is beauty beyond size. And that never, ever, ever fades. Thank you guys.